Hey guys, so today I'm going to mix up sort of like a tinted moisturizer BB cream for darker skin or for all skin types. And what I mean by that is, as you can see over here, I have some samples. And in Korea, I got tons of BB cream samples. And BB cream is mainly for um, sort of Asian skin types, like skin colors. Um, they are kind of like a beige sort of foundation, but um, they're better than foundation because they have things in them that... Um, heal the skin or at least don't make the skin any worse like it is they're meant not to break out the skin they have anti-aging properties and sun block in here and different things like that sometimes they help with acne skin so people in korea or japan china different asian countries they tend to prefer bb cream over foundation these days because um, these things help the skin rather than just cover it up so yeah that is bb cream but obviously um my skin color is not, you know, Asian skin color. I'm um, this sort of shade. Um, this is my summer shade. I didn't use this all year because it's a little bit too dark. But the one that is um, the number 9, this is number 10. But the number 9 one, it doesn't match me. So I only use this in the summer. And I really like this foundation. It's really good. I got all these samples from these um, places when I bought stuff there and they just, you know, they automatically put them in the bag. They didn't really care like if I could use these things or not. So I have all these things and I don't want to waste them um, because, I don't know, I figured I could always mix them with my foundation. So if you don't have any um, samples like what I have and you just want to make like a basic tinted moisturizer you can obviously just use any moisturizer that you have this one I definitely recommend because it's very light it will make your face look greasy in combination with the foundation and it has SPF 30 and I really like the way this feels this is one of my favorite products ever but today I'm just going to use my samples and my um, foundation that I already have here so I just thought I would show that just in case um, I'm going to mix it up in here. This is kind of big. I wanted to put it in something smaller, but I couldn't find what I was looking for. So I'm just going to mix it up in here. And then I might transfer it into something else later. But yeah. I also have this little spatula to mix up everything. And I'm going to squirt the BB cream in first. Then I'm going to add my Revlon Photo Ready in Caramel, which as I said is a bit too dark for me and I don't really use it really, not these days. I tend to use my, um, what is it called, Makeup Forever one. So I'm thinking if I mix this light BB cream with this foundation that is a bit too dark for me, it might work out to be perfect. Okay, so that's about it um, for now I'm gonna leave it in this container but I might transfer it um, into the photo ready pump later but just so you can see better I mix it up in here and let's see how it looks and like I said a little bit goes a long way and it feels really really silky feels very like it looks very matte and it kind of made my foundation not slide around as much as it would normally so that's pretty cool 